guys, what is going on? Nick here with Gear Nut, and today we're gonna talk about something I never thought I would feature on my channel. But this is something I've been using every day. I haven't been carrying it, uh, well I guess I kinda have been carrying it because it has been in my beard every day. For the last couple of weeks, um, I wanna say two weeks, maybe three weeks. But anyhow, I was scrolling around on Facebook one day Actually, let's start from the beginning. The beginning was uh, end of June, June, July. I started growing a beard. I needed a change, and, you know, I was like, let's let's try to grow a beard. And everybody's like, oh, no, don't grow a beard in the summertime. You're crazy. So I was like, I'm going to do it anyways. So I did, and I really, really enjoyed having a beard. It was just something I liked, and I just went with it. So I'm going to roll in a beard shot. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's pretty cool. But... I don't know, I really enjoyed it. But anyhow, back to the to the beard commander. I really wish someone would have took the time or introduced me to Scott and his company, beardcommander.com, because his product it w is exactly what I was looking for. I wanted a beard balm or a beard oil that had a manly smell or a smell I could wear every day. Not something that made my face smell like a pumpkin or holiday or festive. I, I didn't want to do that. It was June and July or August, you know, and I was like, no, I don't want to do that, you know. So anyhow, once I seen an advertisement or I don't think it was an advertisement. I think I just scrolled across his uh, company one day on Facebook and I was like, what the heck, you know, let's place an order and let's see what happens. So I ended up purchasing these four little samples. And if you're wondering how his samples ship, they ship in these little plastic containers. There's plenty enough of this to get an idea of what the bomb is like, what it smells like, and if you like it or not. So let's start off with my favorite and we'll go down the list as it goes. I ordered four of them. I or ordered a damage control. So he has damage control and he has wonder bombs and they're both freaking awesome. I would highly recommend buying at least one damage control and a couple wonder bombs. That's that's what I did and I would do the same thing again. But this damage control is actually bourbon barrel and this is my favorite out of all the ones I've seen so far. This is the number one go-to. I really love the smell but I don't wear it all the time because I treat this as damage control because that's what it's branded. So number two on my favorite list and my wife and I fought back and forth between Southern Woods and Irish Cream. Hers is Southern Woods. That's that's fine. We're talking about me. So my favorite, my second favorite, I guess you'd say, for the scent smell is going to be Irish Cream Wonder Bomb. This stuff smells like vanilla. It's it's really hard to describe it. You pretty much have to place an order and see if you like it or not. But I really love this Irish Cream. It's it's my favorite. So. I ended up making another order. We'll talk about that in a second. Uh, number three is going to be Southern Woods Wonder Bomb. Now, Southern Woods, it you pretty much have to smell it. It's got its own scent. It's, oh man, it's awesome. You know, this, this is perfect for some of my occasions I would wear it in. So, you know, it's nice to have a rotation uh, because, you know, some days you're, you're gonna wanna smell different. You know, you're not gonna wanna smell the same every single day. Uh, the last one, and this was the biggest shocker. I I was thinking this was going to be number one, but the last one, the Wonder Bomb that made the last or least favorite of the bunch is Coffee Bean for me. Now, there's a lot of people that really love this smell, but it doesn't last as long in my beard. Maybe it's, you know, maybe I'm just wearing it on the wrong days and I'm sweating and working, but... I don't know, it's a, it's a great smell. It's kind of like a caramel coffee kind of smell. You would have to judge it for yourself because everybody picks it up just a little bit different. But it's still a freaking awesome scent. But it's the least favorite out of the bunch. And I kind of surprised myself. So I wanted to place another order and I wanted to make a video for Scott because when he ships these to you, he packages them phenomenally. <laughs> I mean, there is presentation to you when you open your box. At least in my case, both of my cases, he presented the product extremely well. I mean, perfectly out of the box. You know, he ships them in a nice cardboard box. 
it, extremely fast shipping. Uh, I live in Nebraska. He, he's down in Texas, and I got it within a couple days. So um, when he ships you your samples, your samples are going to come in your little plastic container, and they're going to come individually bagged in a Ziploc bag. Now this is another one I ordered for a certain special somebody that I'll be seeing sometime this week or next week. So I can't tell you who that is right now, but they're going to get a sample of that. So anyhow, when you order your Wonder Bombs, your big containers, they're going to come in a tin container. I haven't opened these up yet, and I wanted to open them up on camera. So let's take and pop one of these open and see. So a very heavy duty Ziploc bag, and he's actually got some plastic wrap around the container. So it gives you that added security of it not melting and getting all over the packaging inside the box. <laughs> so pretty cool. This is Irish cream. I already know I'm going to love this stuff. Not sure if it's a twist off or if it's just a pry off. I think it's just a pry off lid. So let's just pull it off. All right, there you go. So you get quite a bit. Oh man, that smells good. Oh, <laughs> it's just awesome. So pretty awesome. Um, I really do like these containers. They're very, very stout. They're very sturdy. Um, this one has a really good seal. I'm having an issue pushing the lid back down, but that'll change over a little bit of time. As you guys can see, he did send down some free stickers. He has two different designs. I believe this was his first design of his company. And how cool is that? You know, throw that on a Yeti cup, throw that on a gun case, or maybe your gun cabinet when you're steel safes. That is just awesome. You know, shave when you're dead. It's just really cool. And this is the newest sticker design that Scott has made for BeardCommander.com. And look at that. Little hatchets right on there. That's, that's freaking awesome. So he's got a lot of stuff going on over there. He's got a pretty sweet comb. If you're looking for a beard comb, definitely go check his out. Um, I'll probably end up picking one of those up eventually uh, as soon as I make some little more money. And that's what we'll do. But let's open up this damage control because this is going to be different than the Wonder Bomb. So same deal, it comes in a Ziploc bag and it has that heat shrink film. You can open this without a knife, pretty simple to do it. But it's really nice to see that he has the attention to detail and this stuff's not going to... Look at that, perfect. You know, both of these are perfect. They didn't melt. It was 94 degrees today when this was delivered and it didn't melt. So great job, Scott. <laughs> Keep up the fantastic packaging and shipping. And wait a minute here, I didn't get to smell this one. Oh, bourbon barrel, <laughs> that's so good. So anyhow, if you are in the market for a beard bomb, go check out beardcommander.com. Uh, I didn't get paid for this or anything like that. I purchased all of these myself. I, he did send some stickers, so that might just be something that Scott does. Um, it's just really cool. I'm not even going to try to pronounce your last name, Scott, because I would probably butcher that. But if you guys want to check it out, description box below, I'll have a link to his Facebook and I'll have a link over to his website. Uh, every once in a while, he does have a giveaway for a beard bomb on Facebook. So go over there, show him some support, and maybe you'll win one of those when he has his next giveaway. So Nick here with GearNut. Hope you enjoyed this. And I would highly recommend checking out Beard Commander. It's my favorite bomb so far. I'll check you guys later.